All right, and so this is one song built as a module. Uh, this is Eurorack. It's an 8 HP panel. Uh, here we have the same controls of time, length, uh, play, and new. Uh, I, th I can't remember if I refer to it as play or trigger in the documentation, but uh, either way, it's telling it to play the currently written melody. Uh, and then we have some inputs for external clock and then gates and triggers that can act as uh, your play and new. And then this switch over here is only used when you're using an external clock, so I'm going to cover that in the next demo. Uh, but I've got a patch set up here. There's three outputs. There's the audio output, which no longer has the volume control when built as a module. Then there's the trigger output. Uh, trigger output is sending a, a trigger signal every time that the note changes on one song. And then clock output is the clock of the system, which if you're unfamiliar with modular systems, a clock is a, a steady length, uh, not steady length, steady tempo series of pulses that you use for timing and interacting with other uh, modules. And I've got the trigger out set to adjusting the cutoff of this filter down here, which is taking our output. Uh, going through an AR generator first to adjust the cutoff, and then the clock out is going to a divider, and the outputs of that divider are going to a couple of drum modules I have up here. So it should sound like a full-on... It should sound like, you know, a bunch of stuff happening when we press play. So let's listen to it, and I'll set it to a relatively short uh, song length here. <laughs> That was a weird song. <laughs> that was just one note uh, for a really long time, and then something else. Um, so I'm going to hit new, so it'll be a different song. I will slow it down a little bit, and I'll go ahead and just monkey with my controls kind of randomly. So it should sound like kind of a different thing. I'll increase my filter cutoff, shorten that, shorten the amount of change. Let's see if this sounds like something totally different. Hit new a few more times. Yeah, that was a way different song. Uh, let's try something faster, but a little longer. Um, and I'll go ahead and change my divisions so that they're... Uh, we're not going to get quite as many uh, beats. I'll increase this one. So let's see how, what this sounds like. So that's uh, just an example of how you can use this thing to uh, make music. Uh, all right, thanks. Next is going to be a, a demo showing uh, using these external inputs, which shouldn't be uh, too complicated.